Fresh. Gives fish the good flavor. Wait, but fish is fish. Did you create the sauce? Fresh. The sauce. They're both right. And that's the news from Bird's Eye. Seafood frozen fresh from the sea in butter sauce with lemon and white wine. This new vacuum sealed cooking pack makes it possible. Quickly frozen, then vacuum sealed in a sauce created with butter, lemons, a touch of white wine. Seafood by Bird's Eye, fresh from the sea. Try all five new seafood dishes from Bird's Eye. In the 60s, vacuum technology was new, exciting, and... Fresh! It's what you do with it. It was just being implemented in various ways, and it was even the star of television commercials. Fresh! The sauce! Fresh! The sauce! Fresh! The sauce! Today, it's difficult to find any industrial production process that doesn't use vacuum technology. Vacuum is everywhere, from hospitals to the food industry, from bottling to printing. Let's take a look at some notable implementations. Stop the presses. Well, they would without vacuum. You probably know that printing presses need compressed air. Blast air is used for riffling the paper. But the printing industry also relies heavily on vacuum, for example, to operate the lifting and forwarding suckers on sheet-fed presses. Lifting paper is light work, but vacuum can help lift heavier loads. In fact, vacuum lifting is widely used in industrial applications like in this plasterboard factory. Need to wash up after a day in the factory? Chances are the tub in your bathroom was made using vacuum molding technology. Vacuum is not confined to industrial production. High-tech industries need it too. Solar panels, for example. Vacuum lamination is instrumental in their production. And making a computer without vacuum technology? Unimaginable. Food packaging is a prime example of vacuum technology. From fish to meat, vacuum keeps it fresh. And your breakfast wouldn't be the same without the vacuum-aided packaging technologies used in the dairy industry. Canning too relies on vacuum. Tin cans are basically airtight containers. There's no life without air. But for hospitals, there's no living without vacuum either. Its medical uses are diverse and indispensable. Vacuum is found from the operating room to patient rooms. Vacuum is everywhere, and very often it's found and needed in places that also use compressed air. This offers some great business opportunities. Many of our customers for compressed air also buy vacuum pumps. Often the same contact person is responsible for both compressed air and vacuum. And this synergy can work in both directions because virtually every industrial vacuum pump user I have ever visited has a compressor and I've visited thousands. When we look more closely it's clear that many of the applications that we focus upon also need vacuum. This means that the additional sales effort to sell vacuum is minimal. We will help you explore this vacuum market with a growing team of people within Atlas Copco to support you and with a carefully crafted portfolio of products. The power of vacuum has been known for centuries. In 1657, German scientist Otto von Guericke set up a spectacular experiment in the city of Magdeburg. Von Guericke fastened together two perfectly matching hollow bronze half spheres. Using an air pump, he then extracted the air, creating a vacuum inside the sphere. Two teams of eight horses tried to separate the two hemispheres by pulling in opposite directions. Astonished spectators witnessed how the horses were unable to break the power of the vacuum. Today, vacuum is just as powerful as back in the 17th century. There's no getting around it. Vacuum is critical to many applications and industries. This experiment illustrates what that can mean for your business. Place a balloon in a bell jar, then drain the air using a vacuum pump. 
and do you want to see your sales figures grow? Then Vacuum is the way to go.